what's going on youtube so i'm back with another update guys so i've been working on my slash 4x4 man because one of the main thing i realize is that the traxxas connectors man no go if you're trying to go 100 miles per hour or you know 110 105 anything above 100 those connectors change them all right i've been through three sets of connectors so far they all melted and the truck I had to cut my battery wires um resolder all that connectors all over again so i finally find i finally solve a problem guys all of me some new connectors i'm yet to connect them I also replace my body again out of the jag delta plastic body this time um so yeah guys let me show you what i've been working on and don't mind the uh, messy room guys pool table is gone so i'm about to be out of the country for at least two years so you know i have some movers here packing up and stuff so these are my connectors guys um ones that i ordered i ordered these castle connectors Dad, yes buddy bailey's back okay tell bailey he's getting cold so you, you gotta stay inside now okay oh my son trying to go outside and play with his friends but it's getting cold here guys well the daytime is fine but the evening time it gets pretty cold so i ordered these castle uh connectors with a series wire so i'm gonna work on those also a change of a servo horn here and um i changed my whole bell crank on my Dad, slash put it aluminum Dad, it's not that cool because i'm learning this you've been outside all day buddy you gotta stay inside now let's get it's about to get dark all right so <laughs> I know you guys haven't seen a truck in a minute. So, you can see under there, it's a little bit dark. I add all metal, aluminum. Um, I bought to add that metal servo horn to it. Also changed my shack again. I had a 2.0 repo shacks in there. And I had the, um, the 3.0 instead. Um, no, the 3.3 Revo shacks. Yeah, they're, they're super firm. The one in one in one ratio gearing. Um, so, in one of my pre previous videos, my buddy, um, Keys the RC, you know, I told him I'd show him how amount my body is. So, that's how I do it, guys. And my other Nerf bar I actually have holes in it all right but this one i didn't have to put any holes in it i just used the, the velcro straps um and as i can see it's, it's it's solid on there it's not even moving and it's not tight because i charge the batteries and i haven't strapped them down all the way so these are the connectors i was telling you guys about as i can see look at that that one is already melting. So I will not run this truck again with these connectors. I'm gonna replace them before I took the truck back out. All right, guys. So it's looking, I add my rally bumper to the front. Oh, and I also added another set of 17 millimeter hex adapter these ones are solid guys like i'm telling you i put some serious tightening and these with lock tight and they, they're not rounding up or anything um and i got me a 17 millimeter hex wrench to tighten that under so these are on there very solid i haven't run them as yet so. and here's the the body guys oh uh oh so i told the movers that 
I'm not shipping these, but they tagged it nevertheless to pack it up. Hmm. Alright. Let's remove that. It was a good thing I came up here to do this video today. I have to move these over here where I tell them those aren't going. So here's the jack body, guys. I just finished painting this jack body today. Uh, it's a two millimeter thick. I tried to get the three millimeter, but it was all the stock. And as soon as I got the two millimeter, the three millimeter came available. <laughs> Ain't that some? I guess they're trying to say, you ain't supposed to have that one, god damn it. So, I did the green on there. I can still smell that fresh paint. And I did the black on the inside. So, I didn't do this part as all that is going to be cut, it, cut out anyway. And that's the wheel base that's gonna be cut out also as you can see guys one of the things that I didn't do is tape my windows and I choose not to tape my windows because I wanted all green all right I didn't want uh, the windows just like I did in that one I didn't want that look I went with a full green on there plan on getting some stickers and make it look pretty good but that's what i've been working on guys um in between parking in between parking and visiting families i was in texas this weekend was my birthday on the 20th my, my wife had a birthday on the 12th and our anniversary was on the 16th <laughs> November is a busy, busy month for us, guys. And uh, we have some friends that, um, brothers and sisters, like three brothers and sisters, they all have birthday in November also. So it's a pretty busy month for us um, in between parking up and all of that stuff. So I'll keep you guys updated, man. Um, I haven't posted a video in a, over a week or maybe going two weeks or so. So I try to keep you guys updated. All right, stay safe, man. Stay blessed. I know the corona and stuff is acting up. Not only here in America, but all over the world, man. So, you know, protect yourself, protect your loved one, protect your friends, protect strangers. If you go in public areas that require you to wear a mask, just go ahead and wear one, all right? Stay safe, man. Stay blessed. One love, one heart. Peace.